Of course they went out. <laughs> So for a hatching pod, I would say this is successful. Uh, as far as them laying eggs yet, uh, we haven't seen that. And I haven't seen the mating, which the flies don't become sexually mature for about two or three days. But they are getting all mounted up on the uh, corn stalk there. And that's where we were expecting them to mate, so we'll see. We'll be back in a couple more days. Although right now it's about 90 degrees. And today's forecast is 100 to 102. Which I'm guessing will work just fine for these guys, but we will see. Haven't seen any dying yet, so... Got all sorts of them. There are well over a hundred flies in here. So putting them in the soil definitely helps. And there's a pair meeting over there against the side of the fin. So she'll start laying eggs real soon. And there's another pair mating on the leaf right there. So conditions are good. Another day or so or less I will be seeing a bunch of Females over here laying eggs. And I'll probably have more black soldier flies than I know what to do with. Anybody want some? Give me a call. Look it up. Now that we have such a good hatch, I'm looking at the produce that I've got down here, and a lot of it is probably dried out. So, what I've done is I've soaked a couple gallons of grain and I'm going to dump it in there hopefully to entice them to lay their eggs on the cardboard but if they don't lay it on the cardboard they may lay it close to the barley and then I can get the larva out at another time and move them into another bin okay I'm going to set this here for now I'll probably lose some flies on Hopefully not too many. Oh, yeah, there's about ten. Well, that ain't too bad. Part of the reason I soaked the barley was the females want to sense that the larvae are going to have enough moisture when they hatch. So this should give them good reason lay their eggs in this area. There we go. Alright. So the next video will be either me taking out the cardboard full of eggs or taking out the barley full of larvae. We have definitely got a couple hundred of flies. This morning, day 10, I videotaped about a hundred. Now there's at least double that. Tomorrow I'd expect even more. We have uh, a 
kind of overseeded this, so <laughs> we'll see how it goes. You can see they're down on the they're down on the wall where the produce is. So they might already be laying some eggs. It'll be a week or so before I even see any larvae around here though. Today it's about 100 degrees and it is hot. We're underneath a, a greenhouse tunnel and so it's probably an extra five degrees warmer in here. The flies don't seem to be perishing because of it but it is awfully warm. This is day 12. Plenty of females. I don't see as much mating going on today, but it's a little colder. But, I'll bet you, she's laying eggs. Not exactly on the cardboard like I wanted, but she's laying it so it'll fall into the grain. We got lots of them. That's what a female looks like when she's laying eggs, but Usually moving around a little more, <laughs> so it might be because it's a little cooler today. I'm putting my estimate at about 250 flies in here. We'll see how it goes.